this topic is about leave my Facebook alone. Okay. This is what I'm talking about that where I'm saying leave my Facebook alone. When there's times that people would post something and then they would post and then somebody would say, what the hell? What the hell did they just put? Well, don't worry about what they put. If it's something that you don't like, either delete it out of there or put on hit and post. Instead of blocking somebody or reporting them, now if they're messing with your account, and your Facebook and they were doing on your timeline then I would understand I don't know my auto's messing up because my this is my tablet is not the best tablet in the world and I don't know if it's working good or not well anyway I'm just doing the best I can bear with me please see just like this I'm worried about what everybody else is thinking instead of just going with my story. Instead of thinking about what I should be telling people of like why you're being this way. Why you're trying to hurt somebody just because they're not in your boundaries. They're not in your level. That's like judging somebody to not be you. That's not cool. Would you want somebody to do that to you? Would you want somebody to make you feel that way? And you say, I ain't going to be that way because she's like that or he's like that. Well, same goes for them. Why they got to be like you? They might not think the same as you. But who cares? At least you're spreading out your feelings. At least you're spreading out what's your what's on your mind, what's bothering you. Sometimes it's good to let shit out so the shit don't stay in and constipate you. I mean, that's just the way it is. But when people are messing with your Facebook or your YouTube, or, I mean, yeah, I'm not saying to get carried away and do the worst, but if there's something that people don't want to hear, or don't want to see, well, either get rid of it or hide it. Because that's why there's such things as worse like that. So you can able to escape from it. And you won't have to deal with it. And if it keeps on coming back, well, then keep on doing it. It'll eventually go away. And, uh, but I'm just saying, it's like, why go and cause drama, cause pain, violence, because you want to be a bully, selfish person, just because you whine about something. I mean, I'm sorry, you want some cheese with that wine? I mean, let me know, because I'll be glad to give you some cheese, because you're sure are whining. But... And if a, and if somebody does get carried away, block them out of your friendship list. Don't hurt them. Don't destroy them. Just block them out of your friendship list. Of Facebook or YouTube or whatever. Wherever that has on there. Even if it's on other apps. But there's no point of starting violence or going to murder somebody because you're too sensitive to handle it. Hey, believe in me, I've been some, through some shit that where I was too sensitive, but I still try to handle it because I don't want to be like that. I don't want to stoop to that level to hurt somebody when all they're going to do is make another one anyway. You'll just, that'll just be another one away. But why do that when, whenever you might end up seeing them? Because if they make a new account, and they make a new account, and then you're going to see them. Then you have to block them again or destroy their Facebook. No. 
Instead of doing that, just block them. Let them go. If it bothers you that much to let them go, then don't worry about it and get over it. But just do what you got to do. Do what pleases you. And if there's something you don't like, then either block the person or just put that hidden post. And then they'll be everything fine. As long as they're not trying to put the crap on your timeline or harassing you or bothering you. And then that's all you got to do. Well, I don't know what else to talk about, but I'm going to say this. Now I'm going to say about my YouTube. Y'all might not like, and I may seem boring. I may seem like y'all not having fun listening to me talk. Oh, man, if we were to listen to somebody talk like this, we might as well just go talk to one of our buddies. You know, well, whatever. But I'm not trying to make you listen to me. I'm trying to let you learn from what I knowledge from what you should learn from in life that is going on. Do not do wrong in life. Do not do wrong in life. And to help yourself and others do the life that they're going through. And that's what I'm trying to do. I'm not trying to make you listen to my problems. I'm not talking about my problems because I leave that to myself. Because, honey, if I'm not going to handle it myself and I expect everybody to do it for me, how am I going to ever handle it? There'll be no way. I'll be too drowned and weak. And I won't be able to save my own self. That's what i got to do. And I'm trying to do the same for everybody so their lives won't be through what I go through. And it's like y'all my babies. I mean, that's all. And I want to protect my babies. And that's just the person I am. So this is the way my YouTube is going to be. And I'm just letting y'all know that if if I'm boring, whatever, that's your choice to watch my shit. That's your choice. I don't know. I can't make you push that button or look at it or anything. Only thing I can do is hopefully you learn from it or whatever. All right. Well, I love y'all all. God bless and and hopefully the best for everyone. And and please use heart. Use heart. Love y'all. Bye.